Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I have a very shocking topic to share with you. It's about cloves, the super spice that you might have in your kitchen right now. Cloves are known for their amazing health benefits. But did you know that they can also harm you if you have certain medical conditions? Yes, you heard me right. Cloves are not for everyone and you need to watch this video before you eat them. Cloves are the dried flower buds of a tropical tree that have a strong aroma and a spicy flavor. They are used in many dishes and drinks, especially during the winter season. They are also rich in antioxidants, anti-inflammatory, and antibacterial properties that can help with various health issues such as toothache, cold, cough, nausea, indigestion, and more. But as good as cloves are, they also have a dark side. There is a compound in cloves called eugenol that can interfere with some of your body's functions and cause serious problems if you have certain health conditions. In this video, I'm going to tell you about 10 of these conditions and why you should avoid cloves if you have them. The first condition is liver problems. Your liver is the ultimate multitasker that breaks down substances and toxins in your body. But cloves can mess with your liver enzymes, making their job harder. If you already have liver issues, such as hepatitis, cirrhosis, or fatty liver, this extra stress might not be a good idea. The second condition is bleeding disorders. Your blood has the ability to clot when you get injured to stop the bleeding. But cloves can interfere with this ability, making it harder to stop bleeding. For people with bleeding issues, such as hemophilia, von Willebrand disease, or thrombocytopenia, cloves could make things worse. The third condition is stomach ulcers. Stomach ulcers are like little open sores in your stomach lining that can cause pain and bleeding. Cloves can trigger more stomach acid production which is not ideal for healing ulcers. It can make ulcers worse and delay the healing process. Spicy and strong foods, like cloves, might not sit well with your already upset stomach. The fourth condition is diabetes. Eugenol can lower your blood sugar levels, which is beneficial for those not dealing with diabetes or actively trying to lower blood sugar. However, for those with diabetes on medication, it can create conflicts and potentially lead to hypoglycemia which is a dangerous condition that can cause symptoms such as dizziness, confusion, sweating, shaking, and even coma. The fifth condition is seizures. Cloves can interfere with your brain electrical activity, increasing the risk of seizures for those with a history of seizures. If you have epilepsy or any other seizure disorder, you should avoid cloves as they might trigger an episode. The sixth condition is respiratory conditions. Cloves might agitate your already sensitive airways making breathing even more difficult for people with respiratory issues like asthma or chronic bronchitis. If you have trouble breathing or wheezing, you should stay away from cloves as they might worsen your condition. The seventh condition is thyroid problems. Cloves contain goitrogens that can slow down your thyroid function. Your thyroid is responsible for regulating your metabolism and energy levels. If your thyroid is already struggling, such as in hypothyroidism or Hashimoto's disease, this can worsen the situation. The eighth condition is autoimmune disorders. Cloves can stimulate your immune system, which can be problematic for people with autoimmune disorders as it makes the immune system more active, potentially worsening their condition. Autoimmune disorders are when your immune system attacks your own body by mistake, such as in rheumatoid arthritis or lupus. The ninth condition is kidney problems. Cloves can increase blood flow to your kidneys which might not be ideal if your kidneys are already struggling to function properly. Your kidneys are responsible for filtering waste and fluids from your blood. If you have kidney disease or damage, such as in chronic kidney disease or kidney stones, this extra blood flow might put more pressure on your kidneys. The tenth condition is pregnancy and breastfeeding. Cloves can stimulate your uterus, potentially leading to contractions during pregnancy, which might not be safe. For breastfeeding mothers, the strong compounds in cloves can end up in breast milk, which could affect your baby's health and development. So there you have it. These are 10 medical conditions that could make cloves harmful for you. If you have any of these conditions, please consult your doctor before eating cloves or using them in any form. Cloves are a super spice that can benefit your health in many ways, but they are not for everyone. So be smart and be safe when it comes to using them. I hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family who might benefit from it. 
and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!